Hello beautiful people and welcome back to our How channel. My name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I do reply to each comment as well as messages on my Instagram. And if you are wondering why is that, because simply I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to find your competitor's target audience on TikTok ads. And yes, you heard that right. I will show you how to find the target interest of your competitors on TikTok ads. And this will work for every niche, whatever if you are selling uh, home appliances or clothing or jewelry, whatever your niche is, this trick will actually work for you. And you will be able to discover the interests that your competitors are targeting on TikTok ads. And we will do that completely free without using any paid tools or anything like that. Because apparently TikTok himself already give you the idea. However, it seems like no one is noticing that. Also, I will show you how to find your competitors. We will do that by using the top product tool on TikTok Creative Center to find the top performing product that actually you can go for and we will do demonstration on it. So in this video, you will learn two things. The first thing, which is how to find the top performing products or the products that you should go for or are going really viral on TikTok ads. I'm not talking about uh, TikTok organic. I'm actually talking about the uh, TikTok ads. So what I mean by that in this platform, which is the top products tool, you will be able to see the top products that are doing really good right now based on the data from advertisers themselves. And as I said, I will show you how to do that. And in that demonstration, I will go for a specific product from the things that I will find and we will do demonstration on it to find the targeted interest of your competitors. Or in my case will be my competitor but you just have to change a keyword. So without any more talking, let's just get to it. So I'm going to access, obviously, is the Chicksaw Creative Center. And if it does not open up for you, it does not work properly, make sure to disable ad blocker because that can stop uh, Chicksaw Creative Center from working. And I will also put a link for it in the description box. And here it is, as you can see, this is the top product tool that we'll be using in this video to find the top performing products. And I will show you how to find which ones that actually doing very good because there is some misleading information in here and also I did a video about top products if you want to check it out make sure to check out my channel I did explain each details on this platform because it's really good however let's just click on it and show you how to use it and show you how to find the top performing products in here so once you access it you will see this uh, green arrow with the percentage on it you might be thinking this is good because it's going up but it's completely the opposite so if you don't know what this actually means let me give you a brief understanding of uh, this one so popularity means the how many advertisers are promoting this product which is in this case the first one is the phone cases and screen protectors and so on so you can see here one case so 1000 advertisers are promoting these kinds of products and that did go six percent up in the last seven days because we did pick here the last seven days which is by default you can actually pick yesterday or 30 days i would advise you to keep it at the seven days so as i said six percent more people are advertising screen cases and the thing we need to focus on is this one right here which which is save year stands for conversion rate so conversion rate is 3.2 percent which is the average when it comes to e-commerce so that's really normal and then here it says CPA which is cost per action so what you need to find in here you need to find a percent popularity percentage that's actually going down just like this one which is just one percent you need to find a popularity change that's going down and a CPE cost very low and conversion rate is really high and I will show you how to find that. And you can actually do that by just clicking on the arrows here on the conversion rate and it will sort out the products by the highest conversion rate. So let's just click on it. And here it is, as you can see, this one is 100% and it's going popularity change is 300%. However, this is also can be misleading. Doesn't mean actually it's a good one you should go for because it's only 10 people that's uh, advertising this kind of product which is cleaning and care and so on so when you see really small number of people are advertising it and the percentage is going up all this data is not accurate because very little advertisers are promoting it an accurate data like cpa or conversion rate needs to, to be calculated at least 
100 people so we need to find uh, a product that's actually going down just like this one 17 percent however it has more people that's advertising it this one is just 12 so we don't need to go for this so let's just scroll down as i said we find this one is go is 29 uh, percent going down however only 22 percent so this data right here which is conversion rate is 64 percent is not accurate because only 22 percent are advertising it and it, this will will not be accurate at all so let's just keep scrolling down there is nothing here the highest number is 92 however if we scroll all the way down you can see this is only one page out of 25 so let's just go to the second page and here it is i think i found one so this one is going down by 10 percent and the number of people that are advertising it is 152 so we can tell this uh, data may be accurate which is conversion rate is 42 percent which is really high right and also the cpe which is cost per action how much the advertiser is uh, spending in order to get a single sale is actually only four bucks so four dollars in order to get one single sale so as i said if you base it this data on over 100 people are advertising it i think TikTok Creative Center might get this data right so it's fairly accurate and let's just go for this one to show you the interest or the targeted interest which is what is this pillows and it has to do with furnishing and bedding and so on so let's just say we are doing pillows and bed widgets and so on and we want to find what people are using to advertise this exact product so we can get the same conversion rate which is 42 percent and to do that is really easy simply click on the details right here you see the details click on it and it will take you to a new page and after that it will show you this really good graph based on the data as you can see uh, you can play around with the data so you can for example uh, conversion rate uh, with the popularity and so on and if we scroll down you will see related videos to the products so this is really handy if you want to get an idea about how people are promoting it or how people are using videos to get more attraction and sales eventually and just like the first one it has more 10 pages so this is just the second one and below it the hashtags for it so as i said we need to find the targeted audience or the targeted interest so you can have the same conversion rate right here which is 42 percent and it will only cost you four dollars on average as you can see so to to do that or to know this data you can simply click on audience insights right here you see as i said tiktok themselves already give you this idea however it seems like no one is noticing it let's just click on it and here it is it will show you the age range of people that are interested in the product uh, which is 35% uh, are between 25 and 30 four and 25 percent are between uh, 35 and 44 so on the right in here as you can see it says related interests and in here it will show you all the interests that has to do with people that are interested in pillows in this case and so on and as you can see this is really obvious just from the uh, the keywords here or the interests it says pet treats which is really obvious uh, furniture uh, shopping services because this is mostly for uh, grown-ups people um, not teenagers and so on that's why the highest number is between 25 and uh, 44 years old so this will really give you an idea on how to target the correct audience and most importantly is this data is actually based on advertisers from TikTok themselves so this should be 100% accurate because this data was calculated from over 150 or how many yeah 152 advertisers that are promoting the products and they did collect the data from the all people that are purchasing the products and here it is for you right here so you can just check it out and target the same audience as them and make the same conversion rate which is 42 percent and as i said if you have any questions or any video requests make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my instagram right here below me i do reply to each comment as well as messages on my instagram and if you are wondering why is that because simply i'm working for you otherwise i think my job is done for this video so thanks for watching catch you in the next one